President Donald Trump has pardoned Scooter Libby, the former chief of staff to Vice President Dick Cheney, who was convicted of obstruction in the outing of former CIA operative Valerie Plame. <laughs> Libby's 2007 conviction for obstructing justice and lying to the FBI capped a two-year investigation into how Plame's covert identity was leaked to reporters in 2003 in a case that captivated Washington and ended her career. Prosecutors said Plame's name was revealed as payback to former Ambassador Joseph Wilson, who accused the Bush administration of doctoring intelligence on Iraq in the run-up to the 2003 invasion. President George W. Bush commuted Libby's 30-month prison sentence but refused to grant him a full pardon. Some speculate Trump's move may be connected to the release of a new book harshly critical of President Trump by James Comey, the former FBI director fired by Trump amid Robert Mueller's probe into Russia's alleged meddling in the 2016 election. Libby was pursued by a special prosecutor appointed by Comey, who was then deputy attorney general. News of the parting comes as several of Trump's former campaign aides face similar charges of lying in the Mueller probe. The White House has repeatedly said no pardons are being considered for people caught up in the Russia investigation.